thousands of years ago, hunters and gatherers were attracted to the Tonto Basin because of the water, plants, and animals. From the artifacts left behind, we know there was a transition to farming about 700 years ago. Irrigation techniques developed and maize, beans, and squash supplemented the diet of birds and game. Later, cotton was grown for clothing. My name is Jillian Dyer and I am a Student Conservation Association Park Ranger intern. And we are here at Tonto National Monument. Right behind me are two of the uh, really well-known rooms here at our lower cliff dwelling. If you can see some of the metal poles and the horizontal wooden beam that is for structural support, it was installed in the earlier years for preservation work. Farming led to permanent settlements and as the valley floor became crowded, some people moved to the caves. The last cliff dwellers were known as the Salado, meaning salt, named after the Salt River. change in climate followed by a great flood finally forced the people to leave. Today you can experience the Tonto National Monument and enjoy the birds, animals and plants that stayed behind.